Back on Bill Zavanti. Gonna get ready to put this radio in. All right, so moving on on the Avanti, we've got our radio here, complete with brand new harness, which we are going to get all situated because we're going to test all the original ends and make sure we can mark it to go what goes where. So we have everything situated and correct. And of course, we will try this before we mount it in the car. But look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Beautiful, beautiful product. All right, so I built and prepped a harness here with the wires that we need. Did that the other night at home. So in here, because this car is a factory fader car, which we're going to be bypassing due to the new radio having it all electronic internally. Um, we're just gonna test some wires here to see what's our power and ground and what's from the radio and what's from where. Make sure we're good to go. This is obviously dome lights and such. Um, get that all chased. Then we gotta go in and pull the old speaker out. Put the new one in. You can see it back in there. Get the speaker, ah, get the speaker. Get the new one in. Find our wiring for the speaker back there. Get it ran up, wire up our connector and put her in. God, I'm hoping I can have this done today. If not, it'll be pretty damn close. So I've battled out the center speaker, the front speaker for under the dash. Just look at this. I am sure that's not OE. Because that is garbage. But that's why we're making our own harness and redoing. So our old crusty speaker is finally out. Just look at the horrendous soldering. Anyway, got our new speaker here. We have our connectors, which we are going to put on our high wiring harness we made up the other night. Yes, I gotta put the switch back here. I know it's not wanting to cooperate, so I'll be fixing that later. Need to address this, get this done ready so Bill can actually enjoy his car. It's been sitting here for a while. It's been busy and it's been kind of a long drawn out process and then having to build a lot of components for it and adjust things and just a lot of time. Anyway, connectors here, get that wired up, get that in then I gotta chase my wiring from the rear speaker up to the front, get it connected to our harness, and then we can put the radio in. All right, we've taken, gotten everything wired up here. We're gonna slip the speaker in first. Then we're going to hunt in the back of the car for our rear speaker wiring, to see where it's ran, hopefully locate it. Get it wired up as well, and pop the radio in. It's been a process, but it's coming along.